India's largest commercial vehicle manufacturer, Tata Motors, has signed a memorandum of understanding with Global Power Solutions and Hydrogen Technologies provider, Cummins Incorporated. As part of the MOU, the two companies will collaborate on the design and development of low and zero emission propulsion technology solutions for commercial vehicles in India. This will include hydrogen-powered internal combustion engines, fuel cells, and battery electric vehicle systems. The MOU was signed in the presence of N. Chandrasekharan, Executive Chairman of Tata Sons, and Tom Linebarger, Executive Chairman of Cummins Incorporated, on 14th of November, 2022. Speaking at the occasion, N. Chandrasekharan, Executive Chairman of Tata Sons and Chairman of Tata Motors, said that the shift to sustainable mobility is irreversible and Tata Motors is committed to being amongst the leaders of green mobility. We are taking definitive steps to drive this global megatrend forward in each of our businesses. Working with partners who share the same vision is essential for this transition and we are delighted to strengthen our long-standing relationship with Cummins for their next-generation hydrogen propulsion systems. We are excited to indigenize the cutting-edge hydrogen technology to offer our customers an expanded portfolio of green and future-ready commercial vehicles and accelerate the adoption of sustainable mobility in the country and contribute towards India's net-zero carbon emission goals. The association of Tata Motors with Cummins began in 1993 when the two companies came together to work on cleaner vehicle technology solutions for the Indian market. Over the year, Cummins products and services have backed Tata Motors mobility solutions in India and the company says that this new MOU will further solidify their association. In fact, India will be one of the first markets to receive Cummins hydrogen engines, an important technology to help drive decarbonization. Tata says that the deal is also in line with India's vision of energy for sustainable growth and achieving net zero carbon emissions by 2070. On this occasion, Tom Linebarger, executive chairman of Cummins Incorporated, said that Cummins and Tata Motors have a strong history of partnership and the next step into low and zero emission technologies is an exciting development for zero emissions transportation. Our collaboration in India is an important milestone for Cummins and Tata as we work together to accelerate the shift to a carbon-free economy and a net zero emissions world. We strongly believe that this collaboration is a significant step forward to achieving India's green hydro mission. I'm excited to enable powering a cleaner and greener India. The low emission products of Cummins include the B6.7H hydrogen engine that makes 290 brake horsepower and 1200 newton meters of peak torque. Cummins says that the technology enhances power density, reduces friction losses and improves thermal efficiency. The B6.7H hydrogen engine is being derived from Cummins' fuel agnostic platform offering the benefit of a common base architecture and low to zero carbon fuel capability. The company's zero emission product portfolio also includes its fourth generation hydrogen fuel cell engine, which is designed to meet the duty cycle, performance and packaging requirements of medium and heavy duty trucks and buses. The fuel cell technology are available in 135 kilowatt single and 270 kilowatt dual modules. Cummins battery portfolio includes both lithium iron phosphate and nickel magnesium cobalt battery packs, each of which targets a different duty cycle and use case. Destination Zero is Cummins' strategy to go further and faster to reduce the greenhouse gas emissions and air quality impacts of its products and reach net zero emissions by 2050. Cummins is pursuing a dual path approach, meaning the company is reducing emissions from internal combustion engines while simultaneously investing in new zero emission products. In fact, the company spends approximately $1 billion annually on research and development of future technologies. Please note that this news piece is not an original work. It is derived from the press release released by Cummins Incorporated. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. If you like such stories and want to stay updated with the world of sustainability, 
consider subscribing to this channel. Peace out.